in total disbelief and total shock because the the one thing we knew from every place on earth that's the last place that could withstand an earthquake based on the type of construction you know that we personally have witnessed in that country so that automatically meant tremendous loss of life my name is Reverend John Hearn Jr. and we're currently at Christian Faith Ministries of Garden City. This is the church that sponsors the Caring and Sharing Mission located in Port-au-Prince, Haiti. You know that, that box right there, just to read, not how to play around, about stuff. my knowledge right now, I know uh, clothing has come in uh, of all sizes and uh, water uh, as well, bottled water, people have been bringing bottled water. There are other supplies that have come in today, but I haven't had a chance to go through to inventory simply because uh, I've been out and about today. So I haven't uh, gone to see, but I did put out a comprehensive list of the immediate needs that we wanted to take on this trip tomorrow. And my assumption is that those were the items that were being brought in on today. Uh, check with the staff here to see if the needs have all been met. And we're in constant contact now. I'm receiving a minimum of six phone calls a day. And I'm finding that uh, the more they communicate, the more relaxed they become. For, you know, they truly are in the midst of total devastation and, and deprivation. And the smell of death is in the air.